Now it is time to announce your 2012 homecoming court. First up, Brooke Borosik. Brooke is the daughter of John Borosik and Jen Powell of Ickesburg and is one of three girls. Her sisters are Brittany and Chloe. Throughout high school, Brooke has participated in West Ferry Field Hockey and East Coast Field Hockey. She is a member of a varsity club and enjoys hanging out with her friends and family. Brooke is recognized in her first team mid-pen conference for field hockey and has been on honor roll. She was also voted as senior standout for most athletic. Brooke is attending Penn State to a major in occupational therapy while continuing her field hockey career. She would like to thank her parents and friends for their support. Brooke is escorted by Colin Schaefer. Colin is the son of Ryan and Jody Schaefer of Shermansdale. He is one of two children. He has an older sister named Morgan. During Collins High School years, he participated in football and track and field. He is a member of Varsity Club and likes exercising in general. Colin has received the Coach's Award for Track and Field and was voted for senior standouts for Prettiest Eyes. He plans to enlist in the United States Marine Corps with Curtis Ryder. Colin would like to thank his family for loving and supporting him and Curtis for always driving him to sheets. Next up, Farron Dell. Farron is the daughter of John and Suzanne Dell of New Bloomfield and is one of four children. She has a younger brother, Cameron, and older sisters, Hannah and Amara. While in high school, Farron has participated in field hockey, cross country, musicals, and plays. Currently, she is president of the National Honor Society. She is a member of the concert and jazz band, student senate, Wyla 4-H club, and plays the piano. Farron has received the Director's Choice Award at the Perry County Youth Art Day, PA Junior Academy of Science 2012 first place regional winner and second place state winner, and the National Piano Playing Auditions district and state winner. Farron is planning on attending a small liberal arts college to pursue a career in the health field. She would like to thank her family and friends for being such a positive influence in her life and God for blessing her with so many opportunities. Farron is escorted by Marshall Myers. Marshall is the son of Ron and Ruth Myers of Landisburg and is the oldest of four children. His siblings are Tristan, Victoria, and Samantha. Marshall has participated in football, wrestling, track and field, and soccer. He also enjoys hanging out with friends. Marshall was a sectional medalist in District 3 wrestling. He plans to get a good paying job and live a good life. Marshall would like to thank his family, coaches, friends, and God for believing in Sully is the daughter of John and Tanya King of Eschel and is one of four children. Her siblings are Zachary, can you turn that down please? Zachariah, Gracie, and Riley. Kaylee participates in Peer Helpers and takes part in Eschel Brethren in Christ Youth Group. She also sings in the choir with Red Hill Church of God and is a counselor at Christian Retreat Center. She plans on attending college to study marriage and family therapy. She would like to work as a counselor at a Christian-based organization. Also, she plans to let God lead her life and fulfill her purpose. Kaylee would like to thank God, her family, friends, and all the people who have touched her life. Kaylee is escorted by Kyle Boos. Kyle is the son of Paul and Luann Boos of Shermansdale and is one of two children. He has an older brother, Justin. Kyle has participated in football and wrestling. He is also a member of Varsity Club, National Honor Society, Volleyball, and likes spending time with family and friends. Kyle has been on the honor roll top 30 for class rank and has received the hammer. He has also been nominated for Leaders of Tomorrow. 
Kyle was named captain for the football team and was voted as senior standout for most spirited. He plans to attend a four-year college and live life to the fullest. Kyle would like to thank his parents for all their support throughout the years and also to all his coaches, rest of his family, and friends. Next up, Sarah McDonald. Sarah is the daughter of Kevin and Bobby McDonald of Elliottsburg and is one of six children. Her siblings are Tyler, Mikey, Kelsey McDonald, and Isis and Brooklyn Martin. Currently, she is class treasurer, peer helpers treasurer, a counselor at Christian Retreat Center, and participated in yearbook. Also, she takes part in Eshel Brethren in Christ Youth Group and plays piano. She enjoys drawing and swinging with Kaylee. Sarah plans to attend college and study child life. She would like to get a job as a child life specialist, travel the world, and spread God's word. She would like to give a big thanks to her family, Kaylee, Josh, and Jesus. Sarah is escorted by Ryan McMillan. Ryan is the son of Brent and Melinda McMillan of New Bloomfield and is an only child. During Ryan's high school years, he has participated in baseball, football, soccer, ice hockey, basketball, and weightlifting. He is a member of the National Honor Society, Varsity Club, and is the senior class vice president. Ryan has been recognized as a three-time Mid-Pen Conference Baseball All-Star, two-time gold medalist in the Keystone State Games for baseball, and played on the Big 26 Baseball Classic team for Pennsylvania. He also made distinguished honor roll, has perfect attendance, and received first place for science fair in 2012. Ryan plans to attend college to study physical therapy while playing baseball. He would like to thank his family and friends for all of their love and support, and God for all the blessings in his life. Next up, Melanie Powell. Melanie is the daughter of Randy and Donna Powell of Elliottsburg and is one of two children. She has an older brother, Chris. Throughout high school, Melanie participated in field hockey, track and field, school musicals, Lions Club musicals, and fall plays. Currently, she is vice president of course, editor of the yearbook, and president of show choir. Melanie enjoys spending time with the Four Migos. She has been on the honor roll, recognized as Perry County Chorus Representative, and received senior standout for Class Clown. She plans to attend Temple in the fall to study anthropology. Melanie would like to thank her parents for their love and care, her brother Chris for his encouragement, Jan and Kate Reepsom for her home away from home, her parents for always making her smile, Zach for his support, and God for blessing her with this opportunity. Melanie is escorted by Mr. Nathan Stoshis. Boy, things have changed since eighth grade. <laughs> Nathan is the son of Eric and Connie Stoshis of Louisville and is the younger of two sons. His brother is Zach. Throughout high school, Nathan has participated in wrestling, fall plays, and spring musicals. He was nominated for the Apollo Award. He plans to attend college to major in theater and become an actor. Nathan would like to thank everyone who supported him in all he does. The support given means the world to him. Next up, Megan Reepsom. Megan is the daughter of Jan and Kate Reepsom of Louisville and is one of two children. She has an older sister, Rachel. Throughout high school, Megan has participated in volleyball, softball, and yearbook. She also enjoys hunting, hanging out with the Formigos, jamming in the Beatle, and family game nights. Megan has made the honor roll, is in the top 30 of her class, and was voted as senior standout for best hair. She plans to attend a four-year college in the fall. She would like to thank God for everything he has blessed her with, her parents and sister for all their love and support, Mel, Marissa, and Carissa for all the memories and for being the best friends she could ask for, and Maggie for always making her laugh. Megan is escorted by Curtis Ryder. Curtis is the son of Jeff and Stacy Ryder of Elliottsburg and is one of two children. His younger sister is Madeline. Throughout his high school years, Curtis has participated in football, wrestling, and track and field. He is a member of Youth Group and Varsity Club. He also enjoys working out and hanging out with his friends. Curtis has been selected as Student of the Month, 
hardest working for wrestling, and has been on Distinguished Honor Roll. He has also received the Hammer Coach's Award for Track and voted captain of the football team. Curtis plans to enlist in the United States Marine Corps with Colin Schaefer. He would like to thank his parents and sister for supporting him in all his endeavors. Also, his grandparents, aunts, uncle, and friends. He thanks Colin for the many fun times at the gym and Sheets trips with Liz, for being a wonderful girlfriend and the many great memories. He'd also like to thank God for helping him accomplish his goals and getting him where he is now. Tessa Riesinger. Tessa is the daughter of Brad and Lisa Riesinger of Ickesburg and is one of five children. She has three sisters, Nance, Ellie, and Molly, and a brother, Brady. During her high school years, Tessa has participated in volleyball, soccer, basketball, and volleyball. Currently, she is class president, secretary of the varsity club, a member of yearbook, and National Honor Society. She enjoys spending time with family and friends. Tessa has received first team all state for volleyball, was nominated as a leader of tomorrow, and is a member of the leadership team. She has made honor roll every semester, received a medal each year for being in the top 30 in her class, and was voted as senior standout for best personality. Tessa plans on attending college to become a dental hygienist. She would like to thank her parents and Logan for all of their love and support over the years, and God for making her who she is. Tessa is escorted by Avery Forson. Avery is the son of Matthew and Janine Farson of Marysville and is one of four children. He has a brother, Jordan, and two sisters, Abby and Becca. Avery has participated in football, musicals, Civil Air Patrol during his high school years. He was voted as senior standout for best personality. He plans to enroll in the ROTC, attend a four-year college to major in criminal justice, and fly helicopters in the United States Army. Avery would like to give a big thanks to his family for being there for him. At this time, we are pleased to welcome back the 2011 Homecoming King and Queen, Robbie Wolford and Christy Sweet Eye, to crown this year's winners. I will now turn the microphone over to senior field hockey players and National Honor Society members Jessica Strohacker and Nicole Lisi to announce the results. The 2012 Homecoming Prince is Kyle B. Happy 18th birthday, Kyle. This year we have a tie for Princess. So the 2012 Homecoming Princesses are Brooke Borosik and Farindell. And now, the moment you've all been waiting for. The 2012 Homecoming King is Nate Stoshes.